Michael Stevens, Coldwell Banker, Even Day Real Estate. Today, our new segment, Keeping It Real. Yes, real is in real estate. You know, keeping It Real is, you know, Janice and I have over 50 years of real estate experience that we just want to share with the public. So, all you out there in social media land, hopefully uh, we'll give you some uh, good information that will be useful. Today's hot topic, lack of inventory. Huge problem. Pros and cons? Let's talk about that. Sellers. No inventory, top dollar, right? So you're getting top dollar right now. Pricing is really, really on the rise. That's great. Problem with that is you go to sell your home for top dollar, when you're repurchasing, there's no inventory out there. That's a big problem and that's stifling a lot of people wanting to sell because they have nowhere to go. All right, so some of the options, boy, what we're seeing a little bit more of right now in today's market is rent back. You know. If you could be in a situation where you could rent your home back until you find somewhere or have an alternative plan, might be an option and buyers are out there willing to do it. New construction, no. You know, build, build something. We have great builders hook you up with some new construction. Problem with new construction right now, oh boy, lumber cost, way high. Hopefully that problem is gonna resolve itself here real soon. Flexibility, if you have the ability to have temporary or go rent or live with somebody until you move on to the next one, flexibility is a big key. So some pros and cons for you sellers out there, great time to buy top dollar. Buyers, let's talk about buyers here for a second. Interest rates, geez oh weez. interest rates are as low as they get right now. I know some of you out there closer to my age understand some of them higher interest rates. These people don't understand how great interest rates are. Problem, inventory. There's no inventory, buyers, so many buyers out there, back to helping all you sellers, tons of buyers out there. The problem is there's nothing for them to buy. So they're just waiting in the wings and daily, all right? So because buyers, lack of inventory, if you find a house, bam, you're in multiple offers. We're talking five, six, seven, up to 12 offers on homes. Really puts you in a bad spot. So, some of the things you're gonna hear if you're buying that house is escalation clause. We could talk about it for a half an hour, but we're not gonna do that today. But don't be surprised when an agent talks to you about escalation clauses. It allows you to be competitive and try to maximize you know, your pricing and, 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 and still land that house, all right? Here, just like we mentioned over here, you want an edge as a buyer? Offer the seller a rent back until they go find something. If you're in a position to do that, great leverage, okay? So what else we have here? Be prepared. That's the basic, you know, real estate 101 for buyers. You can't even go see a house or write an offer unless you're pre-approved, you're ready to rock and roll, and you're ready to go. So those things are really important. And also being prepared. If you're currently like renting right now and you have a lease for six months, don't be afraid to go buy now because you have, you know, three or four months left in your lease. Because it goes back to, Go find that house, that dream house, offer the sellers a rent back because they may need it. These are all solutions that we see more and more of people getting creative. So real important in today's market as a buyer, you have to be working with an agent. Number one, you have to know about these houses. It comes on the minute. Zillow, I'm sorry, some of these websites you're relying on aren't real reliable. Work with an agent. You have to have an agent in place so you can act fast. And again, key flexibility. You have to be flexible. The more you can offer on rent backs, the more you can be prepared, the more you can have, you know, live with in-laws, first time home buyers, be flexible. So hopefully some of this is helpful. We're going to continue this series. Shoot us some ideas if there's topics you want to talk about. And remember, call Coldwell Banker Even Bay Agent for all your real estate needs.